to take for this heavyweight fight. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Bell Center in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's an easy first. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! And now he sees a bone fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of Hollywood, California, the doctor. All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. This Come has up. been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in, because it's about to go down go, right go, now. While well, no better way to pay homage to the history of pride in the UFC with this single night UFC Grand Prix tournament, some of the best fighters in the world have come out. Let's see who will be the last fighter standing here tonight. Oh, he just missed with that straight left hand, Joe. Nice defense there, huge block. Tagged him. That one hurt. He's moving to the right, trying to avoid that big right hand. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Gotta find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, man! He's hurt to the body! Oh. Huge shot there, Lance Flush! Gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. He's doing a great job blocking these shots. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Good right hand on the top. He's hurt. He's hurt. He's, hurt. He's in big trouble. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Oh, big left. Faints with the kick. Lee going for the head kick. He misses there. Right punches there. Oh. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. Tagged him. Let's go. Keep pushing forward. Right is open. Stop the right. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Missed with that right hand. Lee 
going for the head kick. No dice. Well, he got clipped to the body there. Joe left his midsection wide open. He's become a little bit susceptible to that shot by almost leaning in, moving into his opponent's offense. Not a good look there. Switching stances oh. here. This could yeah, be it right here. Wobbly on his feet. He's hurt again. Oh, he might be out. They lock up the clinch. Oh, big left hook there. He transitions to the tie clinch. And that one certainly found the target. Joe exhausting work here in the clinch. He's, He's, to the body He's in big, big trouble here. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. He hurt him with that hook. Lee gets tagged by the kick there. He couldn't have liked that too much, Joe. Right on the button. Straight right hand now, just misses. 20 seconds to go in round one. Really missed with that right hand. 10 seconds to go in round one. And he lands it to the leg. Trying to hammer that big oh, leg. Oh, oh. Round two next. And there is the horn. Big five minutes for him there. Great round from Lee. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. The original Ariane Celeste, good to have her in the building as usual. Absolutely insane. Both guys hurt on multiple occasions. If they continue it this way in this round, someone's gonna get knocked out. Oh, beautiful kick to the body. High kick, very nice high kick. Lands a kick to the leg. Ooh, blocks the shot. How about that chin? He tagged him with that right hand. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Lee's bruise on that thigh, Joe, is hard to even look at. Man, he is in big trouble here. He's wincing in pain. Hard straight punch. Went for the head kick. And there he swung with a haymaker. Well, Joey seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes. Whoa! He's hurt! All right, well, he gets back to his feet here, Joe, but he looks like he is in a world of trouble. Just over three minutes to go. Picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. 
That strike will count. Hand speed, man. Oh! And he connects there, Joe. Connects him with the left. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. This could be it. Really, is that one oh. appeared to stun him? Just over two minutes now to go in round two. Oh, that's a stiff jab there, and it again lands exactly at the intended target. And defensively, Joe, his approach here is leaving a lot to be desired. He's got to figure out a way to move that head and get it off of that center line. Oh, and he's down. Oh, we heard him again. Knockout victory. Yeah, Joe, I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout, and that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight. Check it out again. Bam! Nighty night. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 24 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been Bruce Lee's best performance inside the octagon. Davies, talk that talk.